It is time for me to let my Harman Kardon TD4400 tape deck go. I have too many tape decks. I got this JVC 3-head. I got a Sony 3-head with Dolby S. I got a Revox. I don't, I don't know. I can't justify having so many. So this one is going to be the one to go. And I own it because it's one I had a long time ago. Bought it new. Owned it a month. I was stunned at how good it recorded tapes. And then a cretin broke into my apartment and took like 400 of my albums and CDs and all my stereo components. And I just did that thing you do where some years pass, you want to revisit things. And I bought another one. I have no purpose for owning it. So I'm going to let it go. I've just demagnetized it, cleaned it. It's in good shape. Uh, and I'm going to give a quick demo of its function here. We're going to play something from the YouTube audio library. We're going to play something called Lazy Sunday by uh, Vendretti. Uh, and I can play this so it won't get flagged when I upload this to YouTube. And we're going to record under this recorder here. So I'm going to go ahead and get the recording start. And I will hit record on this. And we're going to wait for it to get past the leader. I'll start the music and I can give you a before and after of what it sounds like. this now does not have a level and we'll hit playback Hopefully that is sufficient. A few other features on the deck, of course, uh, it uh, the bias control is particularly the, the handiest thing around. You can make some of the crappiest tapes sound pretty good. So uh, enjoy. Hope this is informative.